And welcome back to Paper Mario. In this part, Mario's Corpse. Suddenly, stars. Is this like a cartoon where they're gonna spin around his head because he got hurt? He's like, Hope tomorrow's okay and uh <laughs> Great and Koomba now <laughs> now I is really in trouble. Uh oh, even a Goomba's worried about us. That's cute. So yeah, it's... I shouldn't really have to read this to you. I, I don't think so. But basically what he's saying is that we have to go to this place called Shooting Star Summit. And hopefully we'll find out what's the deal with the these weird uh, talking star creatures. Fakely Mars awake. Really? He's been asleep for days? Wow, that's, that's a bit much. I guess it makes sense since he nearly died. <laughs> the nicest Goombas. A star with a mustache? You're be a star told you to go to Shooting Star Summit? No, I saw nothing like that. Are you sure you're okay, Mario? Are you doing well? Did you hit your head? Mario. I almost feel like this is too innocent of a game to make head entry jokes like that. But how would you react if a person told you that they saw a talking star with a mustache? But of course, he's talking with a weird muffin looking creature. Like, if. I'm not gonna question a world where I can talk to a creature that looks like a talking muffin. This is the muffin mother. Or the Goomba mother. Sorry. I know they're supposed to be like chestnuts, but I always consider them like. I don't know. <laughs> It always reminded me of, like, corn muffins or something. Which is not any less weird, admittedly. Anyway, we'll talk around here for a bit. Like this little Goomba with a hat. This is Goombario, and you should remember him. He's our biggest fan. This is cool. I want to be just like you, 35 and slightly overweight. Seriously, this is a cool family. 
Just the nicest Goombas. As they talk over here. Now, we have to leave right now, however... Yeah, the gate can't open right now, for whatever reason. And since that's somehow the only way Mario can get past, even though he could probably jump that fence... We should just talk for a bit, and... Save our progress, I guess. This is a save block. We can just save from here. But I won't right now. Anyway, and here is the Goomba Grandma. <laughs> That's where I got my name. I changed my name because I became the grandmother. That makes sense. And this is Goompa, another character we should remember. He's pretty busy right now, so I'm not entirely sure what the point of this was. But he seems like a nice old dude. Oh awesome, the gate is finished. So now we can get out of here and go on our path. We need to go to the place so we can figure out what exactly we're supposed to be doing. <laughs> I love the cartoon sound effects. Camby Koopa is here to make sure we were still alive, I suppose. Or to confirm if we were alive, that is. <laughs> I love the... Goombari is, uh, expression there. She just looks so annoyed, like, What the fuck is this? <laughs> Ridiculous! Laughable! Entirely possible in this series. Ooh, a gift! That's wonderful, uh... Wait, I, I didn't ask for a block for my birthday. <laughs> really? <laughs> Mario's toughest challenge is a block. Yeah, I hope not they have bad up in there either, um... Um, no, it's not unbelievable. Pe Peace gets captured, like... ...several times a year. Honey, what time is it? Oh, I believe it's 8 o'clock. Oh, so it's time for Prince Peach to get captured again. Unfortunately, yes. Why do we live in such a predictable world? I do not know, honey. That's just basically what I imagine happens with the people of the Mushroom Kingdom at this point. Like, they have to be so used to it. Now, we're supposed to walk over here, but, uh... Wait. Oh, 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 no, 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 not more falling, uh... He just falls like a little piece of paper. How fitting. So yeah, that felt disastrous. You're back? Dude, if an old man fell that bad, I'd be seriously worried about their lives. You're one tough old dude. I guess Cammy conveniently set up another block here. 
Yeah, now, now we're, that we're uh, over here, we have to just go to the left. Not much else we can do. And yeah, they explain much of what you have to do in this game. So basically, yeah, we stand in front of a bush, and then an explanation point will appear. And if we press A, we can maybe get a thing. A lot of these have coins. Use only one coin. But at this point, every bit helps, I guess. Although if we keep checking, eventually... We'll find it! Nice old school fanfare thing. Yeah, it is, it is pretty obvious, I have to admit. If you don't like the game telling you what to do, the, it, the early parts of this game would annoy you a bit. Hey Mario, you just got the thing that we said we need to look for. Now we can do the thing that was blocking our path. N no, really. Never would have guessed. Never would have tried that in a million years game. Uh, that's less a complaint and more of an observation that this game doesn't have, like, the most perfect game design all the time. And because making fun of things is funny. And we can hit trees to get coins, or we can hit blocks to get coins, or get, um, nothing. Which is a little unfortunate. But if we hit this train in particular, we get the glitzed out item thing. And we also get a Princess Peach doll. And she'll tell you that it's Kumbaria's, so it's good that you found it. And it is, as you'll find out in the next episode. Yeah, I guess we should get out of here now we found it. Uh, and he rolls away. Um, what him? What? <laughs> he just hats from his egg. How adorable. He thinks he's a tough guy. Boss of a neighborhood gang. That's. I love this guy. <laughs> He's just so goofy and amusing. But he tries so hard. But he only does one damage. So do I. So yeah, we can use the hammer now to attack. But in this case, it just does the exact same damage. So there's. You could choose whichever one for this fight. It doesn't really matter. However, now he's just starting to get annoyed. So yeah, very hilariously basic battles in this game early on. Uh oh, the ultimate attack! We're doomed now, and... Two damage. I mean, yeah, technically that's twice as more, but that's not a ton. And we defeated him. You pretty much can't lose this fight, as far as I know. And now explain star points. Well, you get points in order to level up. It's, it's just like experience points in RPG. And we'll level up if we get to 100. And he's back. <laughs> and he runs back. Uh, God bless you, Junior Troopa. <laughs> so amusing. But anyway, at this point, we'll save for real. As I think this is enough for one episode. Next time, we'll continue on our way back home. Uh, yeah, we have our new hammer. So next time, we'll continue on the path to get back to the Goomba Village. See you there.